Welcome to Hanging Out with Robert, that's me. This video is composed of things that I tinkered with throughout the day. For step-by-step -step detailed instructions of those tasks, you can click on the links in the comment section below. This video should contain tips and tricks of things that I've learned throughout the year. Now, I only plan on leaving this video posted for about 30 days. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you very much for watching. Driving down Lomas Boulevard here, I've seen a Volvo S90, a newer one, in this car lot called MF Auto Sales. There it is, sitting over there, $50,950. Rain B, baby. Missed the two minute rainfall, but it got the Panther dirty again. This cat sitting here with this. Cadillac. Doors open, hood open. He needed a jump. And that Cadillac had 15 air codes. Because when I jumped him, he fired it up. It, missed, it was misfiring. So I knew something else was going on. So I ran the codes for him. That battery is D E A D. He said somebody stole it. Probably some kind of drug related steal. You know, I let you use my car for a hit or something. Anyway, we got him started. He's got a crankshaft position sensor, bank two or something like that code. Pretty sure it said crankshaft P0019. Bank two, sensor B. Cadillacs, man. Anyway, hopefully he'll be okay. <laughs> Get him going. If you cut that car off, it's going to be done because that battery is dead. Here's my spare phone, and I'm having problems with the back of it not sticking on. This contact stuff, after peeling it off a couple times, is not staying on keeping it closed. So I got a couple of glues here, supposed to be contact cements type. If these don't work, I'm going to use that stuff I use on door panels. But I'm going to read up on these, try one, and tell you which one I think works the best. Or at least work for putting the back back on my Droid Turbo 2. Down to these two tubes. I think this is an all-purpose. And this is the quick hold. I'm going to give the quick hold a shot. Apply it like I see it. And go from there. Time to fix the window switches and modify the stuff here on Queen B. Man, I probably should have parked down the other end. Up here, it is dark under this carport. Have the switches out. Have that fake aluminum plate out, cleaned up. I'm going to solder all of these connections in here. So that stuff is going to be permanent. Got my soldered iron going. I got some shrink wrap here. Ready to roll. All right, I have my auto down wires on there and the shrink wrap in. Melt a little bit of wire here. I'm going to put a little bit of shrink wrap on that. And then I'm going to solder some of these other wires in here. I'm going to hit the black and uh, blue there. And then I'm going to put my connectors on here that will go to my USB. I have the switches in, the harness in. I don't have the back end because I didn't find my back connectors for my uh, USB plug. So I'm probably going to take care of that tomorrow. And I have all of my weird 3M double sided molding tape patched on here. I'm going to try to peel the backing off and then stick that on the switches. On the interstate. Hanging out a little bit in Toontown today. On top of the board for conquering buildings. Woohoo! Here are those quad lights from the 740s. These things, I do have two corners for it. The little brackets on the wings. I have all the wiring harness on the background, on the back of them for both lights, enough for you to connect to. This one here, I guess it's the left side it was cracked but rolling around in my car that lower lens uh came apart i got that piece on the ship with it i'm not sure um 
if you can get those easy or not I do see them occasionally here uh, they could be bolted off I guess so like I said I do have the corners wires all the mounting tabs I had all the screws together with them not sure where all that stuff is now it's been so long since you started this pro some parts and stuff going to some viewers um, a 740 or 700 series steering knuckle same as the 940 strut assembly somebody jacked up the top bolt probably trying to do it with an impact gun um, also shipping out um, some those aluminum control arms a uh, couple high mileage stickers and a R rear spoiler for a D70. So, take your mom to her doctor's appointment. No, I didn't secretly buy a Ford Focus Geese. If you feel that this information was useful, please like it and share it with your social media friends. You can subscribe to my channel so that you will get notifications of future videos that I post. You can follow me on Twitter, and if you need to contact me directly, please visit my website. And if you have any questions, leave them below, and someone or myself will reply to them. Again, thank you very much for watching.